Hello, this is Mr. Roy, aka the Icon. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and comment, comment if you want to. Uh, but a lot of people don't understand that. Oh man, I'm supposed to be here fur, uh, further. I'm supposed to, because everybody think they're supposed to be further in life than what they is now. You know what I'm saying? Or they always had to regret uh, for, in the past. But life is about choices. And I was talking to people um, on Thursday. Thursday, I was talking to people. And I was telling them, I just said, man, Joe, man, you know, I'm supposed to be here. This job ain't paying enough. And who out the bell. And they tend to be like, this job ain't paying enough. This shit is not working for me. And I said, look, man, it's your choices that make you, you got a losing mentality. A losing mentality. I piss a lot of people off that day, too. You know, there's a lot of shit went down. But I piss a lot of people off because I don't have, I said, I believe I'm supposed to be a lot further, but my actions and my, my choices, my actions, my choices, my attitude was fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I got, I said, it, it was too, it was too, I ain't gonna say it's too late because God works in serious ways. God got his time for you. For you. So I ain't never gonna say it's nothing too late. God had a specific time for me at 31. After I committed uh, bullshit, I got, you know, I got charged with some bullshit, but still, it was like I was in the mind of fuck up, fucked up shit. You see what I'm saying? So my mind was not right. You know what I'm saying? And so I had to sit down in my own truck, which I'm gonna get it back. I'm gonna get it back at like, they, later on that year, I'm gonna get it back. And I'm gonna get my own truck, and I said, I'm gonna sit down and realize that like, I didn't learn all the things I learned. You know what I'm saying? My choices was the abnormal. You know what I'm saying? I get $6,000 dispersion, and no one could know that where I'll get $6,000 next week. It was just not the case. It made me realize definitely due to this coronavirus, uh, with the jobs don't last too long, so it put me in a state of mind like, you know what? It's time to start saving. It started open stocks. It's all about choices. And I was trying to tell him, I said, look, bro, and he was giving me all type of uh, excuses. I said, listen, listen to this. I said, look, bro, I said, what you want to do? He said, you want to be a machine operator. I said, you know, it's a job right by uh, in, uh, Beloit, in South Beloit, actually, in Illinois, that you can be a machine operator. They teach you when they go to school. So you just got to pay for it. Work your job and go to school up there. I don't have a car. Well, work, well, since you got a job, say you want to buy a car. He said, he said, well, my license is fucked up. Well, all these excuses. I said, well, you know, the first thing first is get your license. You got to save up and uh, whatever happens to your license, get that straight, then get a car, then go to school. It's not fucking hard. But motherfuckers, see, motherfuckers don't want to deal with the punishment. Motherfuckers want to deal with the pain to get to the success. Me, on the other hand, I was like that. Don't get me wrong. I was like that. I was like that, that I didn't want to deal with the fucking pain to just get to the success. Now I said, you know what? It's easy to get through the pain once you deal with it. Instead of letting it prolong and prolong and you dwell in and oh, I don't got this and I don't got that. See, I, just, I, I saw blocking motherfuckers because, you know, I don't like motherfuckers that make excuses. You making too many excuses to me, I don't want to be bothered with you. Because your, your goals is not like that. And then I said, you know, and it's another thing I tell them. I said, look, you know what my philosophy is? I would never let nobody outwork me. I say, I, I see you work two jobs, I work one, work three, and plus uh, 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 do all the other, other shit. I said, I will never let you outwork me. And they said, I got another uh, thing I, I do that I don't never tell nobody, but I'm telling somebody now, that I don't like being the smartest man in the room. I like to be the dumbest. Therefore, I can open a book and learn something. I don't like being the smartest man in the room. It's all you talk about other people's lives, like uh, love and hip hop, T.I. And, uh, Kyrie and whatever the fuck he's saying. I love this body on my shirt. He my favorite. Fruit Punch is. Fruit Punch is my, my favorite by far. But I would never let your ass outwork me. Alright, that's one thing I'm not gonna let you do. That's one thing I'm not gonna let you do. Is outwork me. You can't outwork me. Right? Like, if I say I got this hat hustle, like, you cannot outwork me. I said, I see you working hard, I'm gonna work, try to work twice as hard or even harder. You know what I'm saying? Twice as hard, twice as hard, at least twice as hard. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but, and I don't like being the smartest man in the room. I get bored fast. If I, it's nothing intriguing in my mind, I can't, I can't talk to you. 
it's like no point of talking to you. I'm sitting there listening to you, and all you talk about is your fucking relationship. All you talk about is other people's problems and other people, uh, how other people do it. I said, no, oh, shit, you ain't talking about nothing substantial, nothing groundbreaking. What, what, what idea we could do for the future so I can work towards the future? You know what I'm saying? I said, dude, that, that shit you talking about is bullshit. Right, I, I I can't relate. I said, it's no way, no way about my heart I can relate to you. You know what I'm saying? Because you just want to talk about clowns said, what's the next bottle and shit. No, I said, I, my mind way past that. My mind was way past that. I, I my mind was way past that. I said, look, if this job ends tomorrow, at least I got a car and find another job. You know what I'm saying? I still gonna be on my hustle. That stagnated me a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, without a cop, I got a cop. Okay. Okay, clothes and shit, that comes, that comes. You know what I'm saying? That comes. Everybody got their new weaknesses. My weakness is clothes, hats, and shoes. The whole you did clothes, but I don't, I bargain shop because I know that I got to put my money in investing. I put my money in the savings. I put, I live off a hundred, believe it or not, I live off a hundred dollars a week. Now I have, I have a hundred dollars to uh, put to the side so I could buy some clothes and washes and shit. Any the accessory, but I bargain. It would be no more than five dollars to loan and all that shit. Be no more than five dollars. The, 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 the hoodies be no more than thirty dollars. You know, the shoes be no more than thirty dollars. So I don't be dressing to press. I dress to make me feel good. You know what I'm saying? That, that just me. But uh, every, you know, somebody got people out of this world got more discipline than me. You know, I, I could dress. You know, bummy, but I can't. You know, I got a job. I got. A, you know, but I said I gotta get me a car. I said okay. I gotta do. I gotta pay child support. I gotta do that. I gotta do that. Do that. Do that. You know what I'm saying? That's first and foremost. I gotta pay myself first. I pay myself first. Then child support. Then all this other shit come out. I said because pay myself first. That because in the long run I'm saving for a bigger thing. Oh my god. And then so I, I, I went off to the party. I said and I'm telling them choices. Everybody said I'm so proud of you. I said I'm not. I'm not satisfied. I ain't satisfied. And then. They say, there you go, there you go, Mo, there you go, Mo, with that, that hunger. I said, there you go, always looking for the next thing. I said, yeah, I always look for that third thing. I always look for the next thing. Oh, well, I'm not satisfied. I'm, just, I'm doing this. Oh, yeah, I'm doing this. But well, I see the end. I said, I see the end result. I said, I got a seven year plan. I said, pretty soon, I said, seven years. Y'all not, I said, I said um, pretty soon in 33, when I turn 33, March 9th, y'all ain't gonna talk to me no more. I'm gonna call y'all. I said, every fucking body off. I said, everybody gonna be off. I'm cutting y'all off. I said, I'm gonna be so lasered in. Y'all gonna be looking at me like that. I said, I said, I might come back pretty yackly, like once a month to see how y'all doing. But I'm gonna be so laser, so focused and lasered in. I said, right now I'm already chasing my YouTube channels. Back to how I used to. You know what I'm saying? Motivational speech, speaking. How to learn more about stocks. Uh, TD Jakes. All that shit. I still got nephew Tommy and uh, Big Jar and shit, you know, something to laugh at, you know, that's my mind. But to keep me motivated, keep me motivated, because hey, everybody tell me, oh man, I don't need nobody speaking to me to motivate. I said, you, you and I tell them, I said, you don't understand how much that changes you. You listen to that motherfucker, you don't understand how much that changes you, make your ass lazy and focus. And people, you know, I listen to uh, uh, Tony Robbins, uh, you know, I listen to uh, Lancey Brown, you know, I listen to, you know, uh, uh, Thomas, uh, uh, eat, 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 eat Thomas. I think that's a boy name. I listen to these people, and the reason why because it, it they laser, I, I laser in. I, the day after I get done listening to Will Smith, sister, you know what I'm saying, Denzel Washington, you know what I'm saying, The Rock, Dwayne Johnson, you know what I'm saying. I listen to them because what they talk about, I laser in, you know what I'm saying, I laser in. I said, I can't let you out. Work me. I listen to the uh, the Kobe's. You know what I'm saying? R. P. The late great Kobe. You know what I'm saying? What he used to do. Yeah, he would not refuse. He refused to let you to outwork him. You know what I'm saying? And I, I laser in. So life is about choices. Uh, like, share, subscribe, comment.